Okay. Okay. Uh, selesai dengan apa yang trending di media sosial seperti yang dijanjikan ada bunga yang akan bersama dengan kami untuk segmen kali ini. Yes, Malaysia mencipta sejarah apabila meraih pingat emas pertama dalam Temasya Sukan Universiti Dunia Universiti di Chengdu. So please welcome Tammy Tan. Kam 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 jam kam join us here. Hello Tammy. How are you? Hi Tammy. Hi. Baru balik ke? Bila balik dari, uh, balik daripada China? Oh semalam. Oh, so okay. okay tak ke sana? Ah uh, okay. Eh, yeah. uh, ada sikit panas. Oh panas ya. Eh? Uh, mm, 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 mm. So of di berapa lama before you start balik training? Uh, kami kat sana ada empat atau lima hari off. Oh okay. So, so tak ada lah intense every day. Ah mm. uh, tak. Ada. Okay okay that's good to know. Okay ah uh, Temi since uh, ini penyertaan sulung di Universiti Jepun uh, 1985 itu first time lah kan. Nanti 38 tahun akhirnya lebur di tangan anda lah. So mungkin boleh sharekan kepada kami apa you punya perasaan masa dapat tahu keputusan yang uh, you berjaya raih dengan emas tu Temi. So saya berasa sangat gembira dan bersyukur mm -hmm. that I can get the first gold medal for Malaysia and bring this honor to our country. Mm. So I think ini bukan saya ini bukan saya seorang punya effort. Uh, sebagai satu pasukan kami uh, dapat banyak uh, support daripada uh, Wushu Federation Malaysia (KPT) mm. Majlis Sukan Negara Institution Sukan Malaysia. Uh, they gave me a lot of support and mm. help throughout this journey and I really appreciate it. And all my coaches, uh, teammates, team manager, uh, they also gave me uh, encouragement, advice uh, that really helped me a lot in this competition. Yeah, I'm pretty yeah. sure everyone that you mentioned that they must be feeling mm. very proud of yeah. you right now. Just like how the entire Malaysia is very proud of you, tell yep. me. Okay. Um, sebelum ni sebenarnya Tammy ada juga dikecewakan dalam acara Jianshu. So macam macam mana Tammy bounce back? Kecewa sekejap lepas tu boleh bawa balik emas. Macam mana? How did you process that? Uh, sebab uh, kedua-dua acara saya uh, is on the same day. So after my first event actually I got a bit kecewa on myself mm. sebab I didn't get any medal from Malaysia. Uh, but after that, I try to uh, change and control my mindset because I can't let my first event mm. result uh, affect my second event performance in a negative way. So that time, I try to recall back how my coaches, my sports psychologist tell, told me before mm. uh, that I have to focus on myself focus on how should I do, how should I perform myself uh, on the carpet. Mm. Yeah, so that's how I like come back stronger after my first event. Mm. Mentality yes, itu kena mentality kuat. Yes, mentality itu yang yeah. ada sebenarnya. Uh, tell me, um, ini ada dedikasikan kemenangan ini kepada sesiapa tak? Untuk, you know, your parents ke atau sesiapa yang istimewa dalam kehidupan uh, Tammy? For this uh, winning, actually, it means a lot to me. Because mm -hmm. it consider as the first, like, such a big competition for me. Mm -hmm. So, I think this is not, uh, this medal is not only for myself, but I think uh, it's for whoever support me in this journey. Like, uh, my coaches, uh, all the federation, and my family. Mm. So, yeah. You expect tak? You expect tak akan bawa balik pingat emas tu? Actually, ke, I did, lah untuk you. No, actually, I didn't expect oh. that I can get this gold medal. Mm. Okay, masa Tammy nak ke sana kan? Because semua orang tahu bahawa sukan wushu ni selalunya orang akan letak high expectation untuk bawa pulang pingat. Macam kita yep. ada target tiga pingat kan? Mm. Ada tak rasa apa-apa tekanan yang oh? kena bawa balik pingat kena tak kisah kalau apa ada target tak masa ke sana uh, actually uh, saya ada target for myself because i don't want got any deduction on my performance uh. if if you got any deduction then you might have very very small chance to get the medal so this is one of my target for myself so yeah, I think I achieved it. Hmm. Alright, okay. Ah, uh, Temi, um, nama Temi tak tersenarai dalam barisan yang akan kesukan Asia. Mungkin boleh kongsikan hmm. macam mana you menerima perkhabaran ini. You rasa uh, you jangka tak yang nama you tak tersenarai kesukan Asia ataupun macam mana? You were hoping. Uh, 
I hope to, but uh, even it's sadly to say that I didn't qualify for Asian Games. Mm -hmm. But I think it may be a good chance for me to keep training hard in home, which is in Malaysia, before mm -hmm. going to any other big competition. Yeah. So, lepas ni, what is your next big competition after uh, university? For this year, may, uh, so far, no. But I was still like improving myself on mm. my skill because after this competition, I saw a lot of competitors. So their skill is like maybe is quite different from me. Mm. So maybe I can learn from them mm. and improving myself. Mm. Okay. Yang penting, I rasa uh, bukan kita je tapi ramai yang menonton ni akan rasa Temi ni adalah sesuatu inspirasi untuk mm -hmm. you guys mencapai Betul. Uh, sesuatu. Congratulations on you. getting your mm -hmm. first gold medal in University. Ya, yeah, dan kami juga merasakan Temi adalah satu permata yang kita must invest in untuk masa depan sukan bushu negara. So hopefully we get to see more of Temi in future. Yeah, thank, thank you so much for coming to Nadi Weekend. Good luck, all the best untuk masa depan anda. Okay.